I must level with you, level with the, the British public. Um, more families, uh, many more families, are going to lose loved ones before their time. Mass gatherings require to be policed. They require to have emergency ambulance cover. We are minded uh, now that we will advise the cancellation, uh, also from the start of next week, of mass gatherings of 500 people or more. Schools, colleges and childcare facilities will close from tomorrow. Big decisions will be, will be made over the next few weeks. Whole families to isolate for 14 days if one person in that household um, is infected. The main therapy is oxygen, they may need a ventilator. Now that's where we've seen the biggest pressures on hospitals in Italy and China. Now the big unknown is what proportion of the UK population are going to get this and we simply don't know that yet so we don't know what the pressure will be. In the Dow Jones that's despite the fact the US authorities, the Federal Reserve, put in a trillion dollars worth of uh, funding to get the markets going again. A trillion dollars to get the markets going again, to get the markets going again, to get the markets going again. Tonight all schools, colleges and nurseries were closed until the end of the month and mass gatherings have been banned. This was the picture in one supermarket. We filmed this in another store. The queue for essentials stretched along every aisle as a nation asks family and friends to stay apart and hunker down. It's frightening that people will eventually be kind of going in here to stock up on food, and given the fact that it's a crisis. The newspaper is saying that they're going to close soon, so I just made some stock to make sure that I will be at wedding. And that is the bigger worry. What comes next? 1,000 people have now died since the first cases of coronavirus there six weeks ago. More than 15,000 people are infected. Tonight, all Catholic churches across Rome are being closed, unprecedented in modern times along, of course, with the closure of shops, restaurants, schools and a raft of other venues as well. The Milan Stock Exchange has just had its biggest ever one-day fall. The economic impact is huge and, of course, the impact also on a very, very struggling healthcare system now. The virus is dangerous because it attacks the tissues and airways deep inside the lungs. I'm wondering if once I've had the illness and if I thankfully um, get over it, um, I'll then be safe because I'll be immune. Is that the case? Well, the truth is we don't know. Well, the truth is we don't know. Well, the truth is we don't know. In Wuhan, the lockdown is getting tighter. A speaker was installed on the streets to inform the people about the new restrictions. This is Rap the News. Come out of her, my people. Do not share in her plagues. The time to flee Babylon is now. Whatever you can do, even if you have to rent a piece of parcel in the wilderness, go to the wilderness because they are digging mass graves. This is Rap the News.